What are we doing today, Wyatt? Huh? What are we doing today? We are gonna build a tree house. Woohoo! You excited? Yeah. You excited, yeah. Ray Ray? Yeah. Yeah? Uncle Jed's back oh. there. <laughs> We're up by the pond and we've been wanting to build a tree house oh, for a while. So today's the day. Here yeah. we go. Super cool, dude. It is. What if we can make like a hole? Did you know? Back there, way back there. I don't even know if I can find anymore. Papa Gary, he built us a deer stand like this. And every time we went out there, I fell asleep. Mm -hmm. <laughs> every time. Where'd the level go? Okay, y'all, the floor frame is done. Why, wow, it was a big help. Why aren't you bro? Mm -hmm. So here it is, I came up on the high side and I just stood on it just to test it out. Um, but that's it. So now we just gotta get the floor on there and at least they can stand on it. I don't know how much we're gonna get tonight. But then we gotta cut these branches off because we're actually doing walls and a roof and all that fun stuff. But the floor is a big one. What y'all think? It's cool. But well, that's not it. Nope, we're not done. So we are going to do the work on the other day after this day. Oh, okay. Okay, why not? Let me off. We all keep on. On this I'm day. Good. Yeah. Does it look good? <laughs> Gappy. Gappy. <laughs> so we ran out of floor boards. Um, but that's all right. That's what you do when you do a project, right? You run out of stuff and you gotta go back to the loads. It gives you another excuse to go there. But we got the boards on. Got her all cleaned up around the tree. Um, no, you so we got to fill up right over there and then right at the front. So that the vision is the stairs will come from this side because it's much smaller. And then on the back side, we'll have a slide out of here. Jim's a little worried about them falling off, which I can't say that <laughs> either. But y'all, this is going to be so stinking cool. My goodness, look at That's that. Awesome. It is. They're going to have a shot. Hold on to me. This is going to be their front window, the pond. Back over there is where Jed's going to put his house. <laughs> well. And then in the back side, they got a nice little clear shot of woods. Yeah. I'm also seeing quite the deer stand here, babe. Yeah. Day night in the tree house. Day night in the tree house. <laughs> all right. Well, that is, I think, all we can do. I'm going to try to talk Jed into cutting some tree limbs up because you can't put walls up until we got those gone. So I think he can do it. He's yeah. light. He's lighter than I am, aren't you, Jed? Yeah. Speed over, <laughs> speed over, why am I, I went blank and I ruined that. Speed over muscle, right? Still got the muscle. Uh -huh. <laughs> all them boys. We'll see. All I know is I'm always in front of him, so he talks about all his speed, but he's slower. <laughs> I don't know what. Because I'm saving it for when I need it. Yeah. Saving it for when he needs it. Shouldn't you be practicing? <laughs> no, no. All right, let's get him up there. That's good. Good. Get 
kids over here arguing about how hungry they are. I'm the one hungry. <laughs> so Jed did get up there and cleared out a bunch of stuff. And we've got, I'm trying to get it to where y'all can see me and it. I just gotta keep walking. So there are the boards. So we got the top up um, to get it set so we can start putting the walls. Uh, and then I'll work on the roof. I'm losing Jed tomorrow, so it's just gonna be me, but he helped me get some of the hard parts done. But that is gonna be one legit tree house going on right there. I don't know what y'all think, but I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. The kids are pumped. What'd you say, Wyatt? It's gonna be the best day ever when we get it done? Yeah. Best day ever. And when we put our toys in. When we put our toys in. I don't think we're gonna put that much toys in. Yeah, but we're. we're I see uh, Sam in the background. He's gonna be the guard of the tree house. But we're losing light. Um, it's getting the sun setting, losing Jed. We're all hungry, so we're gonna call it a night tonight. I hope y'all enjoyed the first part of the treehouse build. It's been super simple to do. It's just we had four trees in a decent vicinity that are around each other. So it's 12 foot on the outside, about eight foot on the the front side. Hey guys, uh, go ahead. Um um, me and mommy actually thought of this. I was like, what are we going to do for my video today? And they're like, a tree house. <laughs> tree house. So Wyatt's going to post a video about the tree house. And I'm sure Jed will post a video about the tree house build. Yeah. <laughs> and it's been a lot of fun. We enjoy it. Sometimes it's nice to just take a break from the actual stuff stuff and do something fun. So they are important as well. Hoo-wee. Yeah. What a day. What a fun day. It was a fun day. It was. I, it was funny. So at what time? Like 2 It was like 2.30. She's sitting out. We're sitting outside and she's like, uh, we should build a tree house. Well, okay. Let's back up. Oh, back so up. So we had planned to move the boy goats and start a chicken coop. Yeah. Which will still be done. But Wyatt and Raylan were sitting outside on the back porch and they were discussing what they were going to do for a video today. And I just got this idea. I said, how about we build a tree house? And Zach looked at me, he said, why'd you just, why'd you just do that? Why'd you throw me under the bus like that? <laughs> yeah, she said, daddy will build you a tree house. And yeah. I'm like, okay, when? <laughs> when are we gonna build a tree house? Yeah, so then I like reeled it back in. And I was like, well, we really don't have to have that today, but maybe we can go look at some plans and you know, draw it out. So we all walked over to the pond because that's where we wanted to do it and started to draw out a plan and come up with ideas. And then mm. I was like, well, let's go to Lowe's. <laughs> yeah. And the reason I was like, you know what? You're right, let's do it. Yeah. It's because, you know, as a family homestead, which we are with two very young children um, that are homeschooled and they do a lot of stuff. They're very independent in a lot of ways. Um, they see a lot of us, a lot of us doing things for animals, yeah. for garden, for different stuff like that. And they're always involved, but yes. it's not their ideas. Right. They do like it, but it, you know, it's not necessarily stuff they get excited about. Yeah. And so, you know, we always try to act like we don't have enough time. We don't have enough time. Right. Today, we made time. Yeah. I said, let's push everything off and we're going to build this tree house. That's right. Because everything else can wait. Everything else yeah. is happy. The boys are fine. The chicken coop will be done. Yeah didn't have to be today. Right. It isn't like the chickens are moving in it. I mean, they could move in it, but they're fine in their little houses that they yeah. have, which we'll show you all that tomorrow in part two, um, because we have, she moved the rabbits out. I did. <laughs> I did. I was ready. Yeah. So our bedroom is a lot less. We got 15 new meat chickens today. Yeah. This video is getting late and long. <laughs> so we'll, we'll add all that into video part yeah. number two tomorrow. Uh, oh, we got our potatoes. We did. <laughs> we we got... did. <laughs> <laughs> We're yeah. going to so many things. Back to the point here. Yeah. So our whole point was there's always something that you can do to improve your homestead for your animals, for your garden, for yourself, for your house. Um, but if you have small children or if you have children at all, you also got to remember to think about them yeah. and to do something for them that's theirs. And right. just they were lit up. He worked more with me today yeah. uh, than he ever has. Um, I think besides when we did the front porch, yeah. remember he he really he likes throwing the screws into mm -hmm. the into the wood. Uh, so that was why we did it. That's why we're still doing it. Um, it'll probably be a couple more days um, to really fully get it done because yeah. we want to put windows in it, um, actual windows, because right. we don't want anybody to fall through a hole. Yeah. <laughs> um, so, but we'll get out, hopefully we'll get all the walls up and the roof on tomorrow, and then we'll have the windows left maybe. Knowing her, I always underestimate, like I under promise 
no what is, yeah under promise over deliver yeah but she knows that she knows the promise like the <laughs> over deliver can yeah. be done so she pushes me to get that yeah. i'm so excited though it overlooks the pond we're gonna have a door like he said windows i mean it's gonna be a legit tree house and we're gonna have fun in it too i mean mommy and daddy can have date night in there <laughs> throw up an air mattress, throw up an air mattress. <laughs> We can deer hunt all at the same time. Yeah, it's gonna be so pretty. And I really eventually wanna put a bridge that goes from the tree house to the other side of the pond. I think that would be so cool. And then put a tree house over there too. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Raylan, can, Raylan and Wyatt. Yeah, the Raylan and Wyatt. <laughs> Not this year. No. <laughs> it's gonna be awesome though. Let's start with one tree. We might add a slide on it, you know, a ladder, all the fun stuff. <laughs> there ain't no might. Yeah, we're we'll definitely going to add a slide to it. <laughs> Who's going to have a treehouse? Can't have a slide. Right. It's going six foot down the way. Yeah, and we can sit on the porch and fish in the pond. It's just going to be a good time. Are you just, are you adding a porch to the treehouse? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> might just be a house. So we started this by saying it was for the kids. Yeah. It, so. it sounded like a little bit more for Jen. It's for everyone. Oh, it's for the family. <laughs> <laughs> all right y'all well that was day one of a treehouse build yes. um you just got to have the vision for tree houses they're not impossible right. um you just need to find well you don't even have to have trees to be honest with you you can use four by fours right but we found four trees in a decent vicinity like within a, one another some kind of shape like a rhombus maybe yeah it's eight foot on the outside and 12 foot on the wide so it's like yeah. a rectangle that's short and then it goes like out that. yeah maybe a rhombus maybe i don't know but um, Wyatt's gonna have a video and my brother Jed's gonna have a video. Mm -hmm. So we'll link them both below. Make sure you check them out because everything's from different angles and yep. different stories. So it's fun. Yeah, a lot of cool shots. Um, we were safe. Um, I know sometimes it, it doesn't always look like it, but we were very safe. Uh, Jed and I are, let me pause real quick. There's always a chance, even with the most experienced person doing anything that they have done a million times to get hurt. However, Jen and I are very safety cautious when it comes to any kind of chainsaw. So please don't freak out when you see any of the shots that you do. Yeah. We were very careful and very cautious of everything that we did. But a lot of cool shots on all of them, especially with the chainsaw coming out. That's homesteading to me, like not always getting the skill saw out. Right. It's marketing it and bringing the chainsaw and doing the cuts because where we were, there was no power. That's why we're calling it kind of the off-grid yeah. build. Now, we did have a battery-powered drill, but... Battery-powered, though. Yeah, battery powered. Yeah. No extension cords. <laughs> so that's uh, kind of the fun part of it when you get the chainsaw out and it's doing all your cuts and it's rough cuts. It's not perfect measurements. That's the best part. Jeff, it's level. <laughs> <laughs> it is actually. So yeah, that's day one of our off-grid treehouse build. Spontaneous idea, but I hope you guys love it. And that's our life. Spontaneous. Yeah, very. Hopefully y'all are excited to see this end as we are because we don't really have a total picture in mind. It's just got a... <laughs> well, I got a general idea. <laughs> I have one too, but it's like mansions and castles. So. Mansions. <laughs> <laughs> she sees what we're living in. It's not a mansion or a castle, so I don't know why she thinks that. The you know what I mean? I like, always have these divine visions. Yeah, I should have saw some of the stuff she showed me on Pinterest. I'm like, okay. <laughs> Sure. Yeah. <laughs> Not today. <laughs> All right. Let's wrap this thing up before we ramble too long. All right. We love y'all. Don't forget to subscribe. That's right. <laughs> and we'll talk to you later. Bye. <laughs> Until the next one. Bye. Bye. Oh, again, before YouTube tells me I don't say it enough, if you like this video, hit the subscribe button. We'll see you tomorrow. And ring the bell. Ring the bell. Until the next one. <laughs>